What's going on, everybody? And welcome to part three of my playthrough for Alan Wake. In the last episode, we uh, went to a like diner, gas station place, and needed the keys and directions to our vacation love home. And some crazy old lady popped out of the corner and like handed us some random keys and directions. And uh, we we followed her without question. So uh, yeah, I guess we're gonna take our wife into our man house place. Oh God! And uh, she coming? Oh, jeez. Come on, baby, run. No one walks. <laughs> no one walks anymore. Crazy crows. Actually, it's pretty good. Like, I gotta admit, the graphics are good in this game. And although graphics are not something that, like, make me love a game, I gotta admire them when they are detailed and good. Bird Leg Cabin. Who who comes up with this stuff? Come on, honey, jeez. You're using up video time. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, yeah, this is, I don't know, it's, like, if it wasn't, if I didn't find this sketchy, the town sketchy already, like, I would probably would say this place is really nice. Yeah, I mean, look at it, it is, it's kind of nice, you know what I mean? Like an island out in the middle. Yeah, it's actually, it is actually pretty nice, I'll, I'll admit it. Come on, honey, jeez. Do I, I think I like the camera better on my, uh, here left go. here. Let's take a look inside. But I might change it just because that's how I roll. Maybe if I can just keep doing it really fast and keep it in the center the whole time. <laughs> All right, kick down the door. Oh man, kick down the. Oh, okay. Before I thought that was like a. Uh, you had to hold down a, but you don't. Can you figure out how to get the power on, honey? No. Uh, let's see. Well, the back door was open. That's. That already makes Hello? me feel pretty unsafe. Anyone here? That that actually does make me feel right. Like if I just walked into a place like this and. Uh, you know, it was like this, and the back door was open when the front door was locked. That's, uh, that's not, that doesn't make me feel good at all. Alright, I, I would actually feel more comfortable checking the basement before I felt comfortable checking the upstairs. I actually hate things like these in real houses. Like, I, I hate those. I don't understand why people have them. Cabin looked like a time capsule from the 60s, or even earlier. That's eh, actually a nice, it's a nice house. Whoa. Oh, yeah, wow, that's actually really nice. <laughs> I know. I'm like, Going over home and stuff. Wow. The moment the oppressive feel of the nightmare I had seen on the ferry returned. Examine, huh? Whoa. Excuse me? Damn. What is that? I can't tell what that is exactly. It looks like a diver I suit. To get the power running in the cabin. Yeah. To be a fuse box or a yeah, yeah. God, his, his narrating is a little... <laughs> it's not annoying, but it's kind of like, yes... It's an interesting way for the game to tell you what to do, though. Don't you think? Most games just uh, kind of throw text at you. Or like a repeating bar. So, wow, we can't even open these doors? I'd kick them down, dude. Seriously, the back door was open. That's that's not good. Alright. Turn on? No, we don't want to turn on the flashlight. Jump! No, okay. Well, we don't want to go down there. Jeez, you are slow. Kick down the door. Turn the light back on for the two seconds we're going to walk through the house. Yeah, yeah. I kind of see the tracker thing now and where to go, and I knew where I was supposed to be going. Examine? Really? Examine that? The island had once been the site for a love story. Maybe it would be that again. Yeah, maybe. Your wife doesn't seem that into you, dude. <laughs> the old generator had been connected to the power cable. No. Okay, here we go. Turn. Turn. Oh, cool. Let there be light. Yeah, walk out like a boss. Like, look what I did, honey. Damn right they are. Okay. I'll look around a bit. Yeah. Sure thing. Yeah. I will. Kinda. Maybe. It was a beautiful place. I told myself I could rest here, sleep here, and forget about my work. I thought we could be happy here. Hear that? That's all, uh, what do you call that? Possessive or past tense? That's like past tense. Like he's already skepticizing himself. Alice had told me about Cauldron Lake Lodge. The old building used to be a hotel. But these days, it was no longer open to the public. So why are the lights on? Hmm. Yeah, this is, it is pretty nice, though. I gotta say that. 
very cinematic game, but that's kind of what this game sort of is, right? It's not focused too, too much on combat, more on, like... Actually, I don't think this game even has that many puzzles. I think it's actually more of a... Actually, it is kind of combat, I guess. I feel like, like a game like Silent Hill, you know what I mean? Like, it's mostly puzzles, you know what I mean? And, like, running away. But this, I think this game actually is, like, semi-combat and uh, not a whole lot of puzzle. But I haven't really gotten that far yet, so I guess I shouldn't say that. Bam, the door just opens. Alice? Alice? Honey? 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 I was gone for like two seconds. Where'd you go? <laughs> Where'd you go? <laughs> Alice? Alan, I'm upstairs. Okay. Ooh, a surprise for us. Ooh. Well, hello there. Hey. I'm not the surprise. It's in the study. Go take a look. Oh. Okay. Whatever. What a letdown. What kind of what kind of wife does that? That's that's just surprise. Alice. Alice. What is this? What have you done? I guess I have a small confession to make. I thought maybe you could write here that a change of scenery would get you past. Damn, Alice. You. Everyone. Hey, keeps... hey, hey! Just hear me out. There's a local doctor, Doctor Hartman. I read a book of his. He has a private clinic here. He specializes in helping artists. Maybe so now you want to get me committed? No! It's not like that. That's not... Alan? Alan? I don't! Just don't! I don't want to hear it! God damn it, Alice! God damn it! I knew she wouldn't follow me in the dark. I needed some time alone to think things through. Oh. Oh, now we can run. What? Birds. Ah, I got birds. Birds. What the hell? I'm coming, baby. Alan Wake is coming. He's trotting along. Why am I moving so slow? Gotta get moving, dude. Alice? Jesus. If my wife was like screaming like that, I just I just wouldn't waste time. Like, I don't think anything could really stop me. I could get, like, shot and I'd still run. Oh, no! <gasps> Whoa, okay, alright, I'll give him props for that. I'm not, like, I would probably pause for a second. No, you know what? I don't think so. If I thought my wife had fallen in, like, the water or something, I would dive right in. Wake up! Alice? Waking up in the crashed car felt like I had woken from one nightmare and entered another. I couldn't remember how I got there. All I knew was that something terrible had happened to Alice. The phone was dead. I'd have to find help on foot. <sighs> Silent Hill reference? No, I'm not going to... Maybe it is, I don't know. What a crazy stop, though, huh? We can probably... Whoa. Okay, let's not... We, we learn from our mistakes in this game. <laughs> we don't jump off edges again. Uh... Examine... Any clues to how we got here? Things was a book. The Creator's Dilemma. By a Dr. Emil Hartman. Seeing the book brought back my fight with Alice. I didn't like Really? It, and I didn't like the guy... How did that bring back the fight? The cover either. And that is, uh... Wow, how did we get... You gotta, you gotta wonder. We jumped into... The last thing we remember doing is jumping into a lake. And now we're in a crashed car, almost off of a cliff, with no lake in sight. All right. The gas station was my best bet. They'd have a phone I could use. It looked like a long hike through the forest to get there. Did it really? Does it really? Because it doesn't. I mean, like. Um. Oh, that does look like water, huh? You know, I don't, dude. If I was, no, I think, I think I could pull it off. I think I could like scale the wall here, slide down, and swim across. Instead of doing what we're about to do, because I know what we're about to do. We're about to take the long way around. Whoa. Damn, so much for that. That wasn't even our car. Look at us. <laughs> Jacking cars. 
I think we do have a certain amount of stamina, so we can't just outrun everything. Which, I gotta say, I like. For parts like this where we're just running non-stop, yeah, it's not fun. But, uh, you know, you shouldn't be able to outrun, like, all the enemies. That, that would kind of defeat the purpose of the game. God? Are you back? God, give me a handgun. Hello? Is someone there? The loose sheets of paper were pages from a manuscript entitled Departure. That was the name I planned to use for the next novel I had never gotten started. I was named the author. I hadn't written it. I couldn't remember writing it. In the scene on the page, the hero was attacked by an axe murderer in the woods at night. That's, uh, ill foreboding. Maybe you should have wrote a happier ending now that you think about it, huh? <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so I think this is going to be a good place to end it off right here. Our wife got kidnapped by that spooky, crazy lady, and we jumped into a lake and wound up in a crash car off a cliff. Yeah, that, that happens to me every other night. Crazy story, bro. But, uh, yeah, like I said, good place to end it off. Uh, in the next episode, we'll try to get to the gas station. So, yeah, I thank you guys for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, let me know. And until next time, I'll catch you later.